A very good morning, student. Uh, myself, Shuraj Singh, uh, Assistant Professor in Electronics and Communication Engineering Branch. Today, I will discuss about the source transformation method or source uh, transfer method basically used in the electric uh, to solve the electrical system. Basically, the, the uh, source transformation technique of transforming one source to another source. In the uh, electrical source transformation, it a uh, method for replacing voltage source in the circuit by equivalent current source or current source may be replaced by a voltage source. The source transformation technique is required to simplify the electrical system for the analysis. There are some rules in which the, we can solve the electrical system for the analysis purpose. These, these are first one, voltage to source conversion. Here in this circuit diagram, shown that, uh, here this voltage source is, uh, and the series resistance R is converted into current source. That means here the V, this V is replaced a v and resistance are replaced by a current source. That means here V replaced by a current source by I equal to, that means I equal to V upon R and the parallel resistance. So here we can convert the voltage source into a current source. That means if the voltage source uh, connected along with the series resistance, then this uh, combination, that means this combination can be replaced by a current source I, which is equal to V upon R and the parallel resistance. And second one, current to voltage source conversion. So here the current source and parallel resistance are converted into voltage source. So here the current source directly converted to voltage source by V equal to I R. Here we convert the voltage uh, current source into a voltage source. That means here current source, uh, which is connected to parallel resistance, this combination, this combination can be replaced by a single voltage source along with the series, uh, series resistance. Third one, series voltage. If there are n number of voltage source are connected in the series combination with the same polarity, then the equivalent of this source can be replaced by a single voltage source. That means it is, if the voltage source are same polarity, then overall voltage must be equal to, here the voltage, total voltage, total voltage V equal to, it is a, combina a combination of V1 and V2. Next one, the parallel combination of voltage. If n number of voltage source are connected in parallelly, then this parallel combination replaced by a single voltage source, that means V1 and V2. Due to in the parallel combi combi uh, combination, voltage are same. Next one, series connection of current source. So if the n number of current source are connected in series with the same direction, then this combination can be replaced by a, a single current source. That means here I1 equal to I2 due to the same current flow in the series circuit. Next one, the parallel current. That means if n number of current source are connected in parallelly, then overall equivalent current must be equal to current, must be equal to I1, it is addition of I1 and I2. That means both current are add up. If the, if N, uh, if the, suppose that I1 and I2 are connected in a opposite direction, if one current is upward direction, suppose that I1 and second is down, that means, overall current source I equal to I1 minus I2. Next one, 
if the voltage source if the voltage source are connected in parallel resistance then also we know that if the same voltage appear in here in this resistance that means this combination can be replaced by a single voltage source next one current source with the series resistance if the current are connected in series with a resistance so the this equivalent can be replaced by a single current source due to same current flow in this resistor so simply here we can remove the resistance that means this resistance replaced by a short circuit or in the in this configuration we can in if the voltage source are connected parallelly with the resistance then means this resistance this resistance reply uh, replaced by a open circuit next one the current source shifting if the current i flow per, uh, flow in resist uh, resistance i1 and i2 if the current here same current flow that means i1 i or same current flow in this resistor across this resistor that means this combination can be replaced by this one that means parallel combination of i and z1 and i and z2 next one the voltage source shifting voltage source shifting that means if node voltage are v then same potential across the z1 and z2 that means here the combination can be replaced by z1 series combination of v1 and z2 series combination of v1 now next one with the help of source transformation method we can solve the some example for this example simply so the 12 voltage uh, are connected in series 4 voltage and resistance 8 ohm and 8 ohm here we can find the response that means we can find out the v not with the help of source transformation method so firstly firstly convert the this combination that means voltage source are converted into current source due to Uh, n number of current source are connected in parallelly then parallel combination of current are added so firstly we convert this 12 volt and 4 ohm resistance into a current source so here we can replace the voltage source into a current source that means current i equal to 12 upon 4 that means 3 ampere and parallelly connect the 4 ohm and the same combination connect here Now in this circuit diagram, a current source are here, and this parallel combination of resistance that means 4 ohm parallel to 8 ohm. That parallel combination is replaced by a single resistance. That means this resistance 4 cross 8 divided by 4 plus 8. That means so here the resultant resistance 2.6 ohm. ये तो 4 cross 8 divided by 12 that means 2.67 this resistance again in the last this combination that means current source and parallel combination of resistance are converted into a voltage source that means this current source replaced by a voltage source that means v equal to i r i r So here I equal to three ampere or R equal to two point six ohm. So this combination must be equal to four volt. And the series resistance two point six seven and eight ohm are already uh, considered as a load uh, according to this example. And the finally we can apply the KVL in this loop. We can apply the KVL. So the resultant output must be equal to yeah simply. Uh, according to kvl kvl we can write down the 8 volt plus 
सिक्स सेवन आई प्लस एट आई देन फाइनली फाइंड द आई और इफ आई आर फाइंड देन वी कैन फाइंड आउट द वोल्टेज नेक्स्ट वन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन यूजिंग सोर्स ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन मेथड डिटरमाइन द करेंट अक्रॉस टू ओम रजिस्टर फॉर द गिवन सर्किट तो इन दिस डायग्राम वी कैन सॉल्व द दिस सर्किट वी कैन आल्सो सॉल्व बाय द नेटवर्क थ्योरम केवीएल केसीएल नोडल एनालिसिस मेस एनालिसिस मेथड बट हियर वी कैन यूज द सोर्स ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन मेथड दैट मींस वी कैन सॉल्व द सर्किट विद द हेल्प ऑफ सोर्स बाय सोर्स कन्वर्जन तो हियर in this circuit we can this this two ohm resistance is the load load here we can find the uh, load here we can find the response so firstly we convert the this voltage source 20 voltage and 4 ohm this this one converted into a current source so current i equal to v upon r that means 20 upon 4 that means either 20 upon 4 must be equal to 5 ampere and the 4 ohm resistance are connected in parallel then 10 ohm con combination are 10 ohm 4 ohm and 2 ohm again we uh, soon that this circuit this parallel combination 5 ampere and 10 ampere are connected in parallelly then parallel combination of current are added that means 5 and 10 must be equal to 15 4 4 ohm are, uh, 4, uh, sorry 4 ohm and again 4 ohm are connected in parallelly then the 4 ohm and 4 ohm parallel combination represented by a 2 ohm again this 15 ampere current and 2 ohm resistance are converted into a voltage source that means v equal to ir that means 15 into 2 15 into 2 must be equal to 30 volt and 2 ohm are connected in series then overall response across response across 2 ohm to so i equal to 30 upon 2 plus 2 that means 7.5 ampere next one next in in the circuit convert the given circuit into a single current source so here we can see the 8 volt are connected in series 2 ohm 6 volt with the negative polarity here converted uh, connected in 1 ohm and the same so firstly we convert the voltage source series combination of voltage source and resistance into a current source so this combination replace 8 volt and 2 ohm converted into current source that means here the 8 upon 2 that means 4 ampere here 4 ampere and parallelly connect the 2 ohm again this combination can be replaced by a current source uh, sorry uh, here the combination plus minus so here 6 volt and 1 ampere current is replaced by a single voltage source here uh, please uh, change this polarity so 6 and uh, uh, next one sorry uh uh, uh Uh, in this uh, circuit uh, please uh, rearrange uh, the uh, polarity here minus and plus to so minus and plus the direction here the direction is down down 6 ampere 6 divided by 1 that means 6 ampere and parallel combination of uh, same this 6 volt and 2 ohm resistance are converted into current source 
that means 6 upon 2 that means 3 ampere and 2 ohm are connected in parallelly again 3 volt or 1 ohm or resistance are converted into a current source that means 3 upon uh, 1 equal to 3 ampere and parallel combination of 1 ohm this parallel combination that means this parallel combination converted into this one this parallel series voltage source are converted in this form this 6 volt or 2 ohm ka conversion are converted into this one and last one this one converted into this again last here 4 ohm and 6 ohm are connected in parallelly with opposite polarity that means overall combination 6 minus minus 4 equal to 2 and the parallel combination of 2 ohm and 1 ohm that means 2 cross 3 2 2 upon 3 sorry and same here the current this goes to left to right and this current right to left that means opposite di opposite direction in current that means added then they must be equal to zero and parallel combination of two ohm and one ohm that means two upon three and this current must be equal to zero that means replaced by a open circuit again this uh, uh, parallel combination of current source and resistance are converted into a voltage source and a resistance and this series con series combination of resistance converted into a single resistance and this one voltage source in the given uh, question ask about the only a current source then this voltage source again this voltage source this voltage source and resistance converted into a current source that means 4 upon 3 divided by 4 upon 3 that means 1 ampere and resistance one, this one last one last question simplify the network shown in uh, shown in figure by using source transformation so this circuit can be uh, simplified by using firstly this combination, parallel combination of current and resistance, and this series combination, six volt and three volt. So firstly, convert this voltage source and resistance into a single current source. So here we can see the two ampere and four ampere. This one, two ampere and four ampere are same, not change. Again, three, oh, sorry, three and six volt are converted in this combination that means 2 ampere and 3 ohm again this uh, series combination of voltage and resistance again this series combination of voltage and current are replaced uh, are converted into a current source like this one and here 2 ampere and 2 ampere are connected in parallelly that means 2 plus 2 4 and parallel combination of 4 parallel combination of parallel combination of resistance 4 cross 3 divided by 4 plus 3 that means parallel combination of 3 and 4 must be equal to 1.712 and parallel combination of current 2 plus so similarly this one so here the current direction uh, current are connected uh, parallelly but in a opposite direction that means 3 minus 2 equal to 1 and parallel combination of resistance 2 and 1 must be equal to uh, 2 upon 3 that means 6.67 again this parallel combination of current and resistance converted into a voltage source again this current source and parallel combination of resistance converted this one so here this combination must be equal to this one or <coughs> this parallel combination must be equal to this one again this voltage and this voltage 
are connected in series then can be replaced by a single voltage source and this resistance and this resistance are connected in series that means series combination of resistance must be equal to this one okay thank you class